When it comes to biodiversity hotspots, there's little debate among scientists about which is the hottest. Manu National Park is the most biodiverse protected area on Earth. It's located at the edge of the Andes as it descends into the Amazon basin in the southeastern corner of Peru. And that is the most biodiverse part of the Amazon basin and the huge diversity of the Andes added to that will result in the most biodiverse park on Earth. Buffered on one side by mountains and accessible only by serpentine rainforest rivers on the other, its location has long afforded it natural protection. But even geography can't stave off the threats from human encroachment. Illegal logging, oil and gas extraction and human migration are closing in. Manu teems with life. This white-faced capuchin monkey is one of 13 primates. Peru's national bird, the cock of the rock, is one of nearly 2,000 types of bird. There are also millions of species of insects, like these leafcutter ants. The number of species that disappear forever each day is much greater than the number we discover each day. In other words, there are species that disappear before we can even discover them. The wealth of biodiversity in Manu makes it a treasure trove for scientific discovery. Biologists say we've only scratched the surface of what it could offer for medicine and innovation. Some, like park guide Nicolas Quinte, advocate an alternative use of the rainforest and the buffer zone around it. The activities here shouldn't just involve removing resources, they should also be productive and sustainable. One of them could be tourism, which uses the forest without destroying it. For now, Manu remains a safe haven for endangered species like these giant otters. But as the pace of development quickens in Peru's southeast, it could become just an island of biodiversity.